No, sorry, no, no, no. I'm, I'm sorry. The moment for the second time in a month. Third time, she just moved the second time. The government simply stuffed up. All those in favour say aye. All those against, I think the ayes have it. To Labor's disbelief, the coalition effectively voted against itself. Did you give it a third crack? Yep. Blindly waving through an opposition amendment that the government explained its failure to close tax loopholes. It was a procedural mistake last night, but it had no impact. It was a procedural mistake. Christopher Pine called it human error. It's a pity. It is a pity. Just as Minister Michael Keenan went missing when the government lost votes a month ago, he was with Kelly O'Dwyer in charge during last night's blunder. What exactly? does a minister have to do to get the sack in your government? How scant and sparse are the pleasures of opposition. We won't begrudge him uh, his uh, small pleasures, but we will get on with the job of governing the... for all Australians. Four times he was asked to back his ministers. Four times the opposition says he wouldn't and couldn't. He could not bring himself to back them in, nor does he have the political authority to be able to stand them down. While emotions ran high and divisions ran deep in the House, there was emotion but unity outside, far removed from party politics and parliamentary procedure, the reality of life and death. Kelly O'Dwyer and Labor's Terry Butler as one in grief and in the fight against sudden death. Our son Lucian passed away when he was four months and three weeks old. Lane Kelcott, Nine News.